On Saturday night, the UFC returned to Sydney's Acer Arena. The capacity crowd witnessed a thrilling encounter in the main event as highly touted and durable AKA standout John Fitch faced off against the talented BJ Penn. The Hawaiian pushed the pace early and surprised the audience as he took down the former Division I wrestler to the canvas. The prodigy showcased superior control on the ground as he searched for submission opportunities. After a competitive second round, the Gorilla Jiu-Jitsu black belt dominated in the third with the signature ground and pound style. At the end of 15 minutes, the belt would be ruled a majority draw on scores of 29-28 Fitch and two scores of 28-28. In the night's co-main event, the outspoken Michael Bisping had a score to settle with Boston's Jorge Rivera. Bisping showcased his well-rounded skill set as he used wrestling to force the fight to the ground. After landing a blatant illegal blow to Rivera, a point was taken and the fight continued and Bisping turned up the heat. The referee was forced to step in and stop the contest at the 154 mark of the second, declaring Michael Bisping the winner. In lightweight action, Australia's own George Sotiropoulos faced off against Russian kickboxer Dennis Siever, who displayed stellar takedown defense over the course of three rounds. Siever punished the 10th Planet Jiu-Jitsu practitioner with his powerful strikes in the first. Sotiropoulos showcased his durability and survived the onslaught. Siever was awarded the unanimous decision victory. In a welterweight affair, the always exciting Chris Lytle was paired with UFC newcomer Brian Ebersol. Ebersol used unorthodox techniques to frustrate lights out. After three rounds, the judges would award the decision to Ebersol. Kyle Noak made short work of Chris Camozzi by locking in a rear naked choke at the 135 mark in the opening frame.